We're broadcasting live from Music City at Newsom Stadium. The moon is full and the fans are ready for a howling good time. The Lycans love carnage, so this should be a good one. Hey, Clinton, what do werewolves love that vampires hate? Now, that would be steaks, Bricks. Oh, I can't believe you know it. This game is going to be a wholesale slaughter. No discounts in the NFL. The team storm the field. The New Orleans Zombies battle the Nashville Lycans. Welcome to NFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. If you're just waking up wondering who put that vice on your head and filled your mouth with vacuum cleaner, dirt, and cat litter, you're not alone. After all, it's Sunday, MFL game day. Hey, you look tired, Junior. And Bricks, you look like they just used your head in field goal practice. Spent all night in the ER. We ate Chinese food last night. Food poisoning? I wish. I got the chopsticks lodged in my ears again. You know, they should have a warning on them things. The defense better look out. The offense called the Beast Boost Dirty Trick. And it's first and ten. And a nice pass for a ten-yard gain. Uh, it's not a first down in the stat line, but it's a first down in our hearts. Second down the size of Bricks Wiener. Hey! Sorry, partner. First down! This guy just loves to hit people as hard as he can, Grim. I don't even think he knows what a first down is. And it's first and ten. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path. And they stack the line and he gets his bell rung for a yard. Second down and nine. It was a risky throw, and the defense made him pay. Boom, dead and down. He just sent a message with that hit. Yeah, the message was you can't kill the messenger, because he's going to kill you. But then he won't be able to read the message, because the messenger killed him. Ah, uh, going in circles. <laughs> Some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sit. The kick is good! Uh, as expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five! Oh, he just got crushed! And it's first and ten. Second down and a lot. Touchdown on that deflection. Third down, and the punter is warming up. And that's another pick. And oh, the sweet mother of fornicating monkeys. He was destroyed on that play. Ah, that's a very weird expression, Grim. You ever been in a monkey house at the zoo, partner? Disturbing to say the least. Just like this. 
And it's first and ten. The quarterback has had enough and calls a murder ball dirty trick to lay waste to the defense. And that defender just got cut. That was just another day at the office for this guy. Uh, you know, he killed his boss in his old job. That's why they drafted him. And it's first and ten. Nicely done for a first down. Oh, you knew you were going to see a lot of carnage today, folks. These teams have bad blood between them. Apparently, they got it from the same blood mobile that usually parks outside next to the taco truck. Raccoon rabies blood is my thought. Always a player's favorite. And it's first and ten. Four yards on that one. And he was just starting to pick up some speed. Hey, Grim, I know a guy if that's what you're after. Second down and six. And he reels that one in for a first down to keep the drive alive. First down and six. And the crowd goes wild. Touchdown! Touchdown! Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stop burrito from Taco Hell. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Yeah, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. Oh, he took a leap and had the ball knocked out. Fumble. He's got it. You gotta love a player who goes down, and that guy is dead. Good riddance. He killed me in my fantasy game. Like, no doubt about it, that guy is dead. He says, I'm taking you with me. The burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? Now, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably cramped his pants. And it's first and ten. <laughs> hit that was and that's how you make a go it looks like we've got a penalty here <laughs> and it's first and ten Another interception. This call, oh, and that's when it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. If I had all my teeth knocked out like that, I'd have to made it the dice, Grim. It'd be fun to gamble with my own teeth. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Oh, that's a vicious hit, and the crowd loves it. He just turned that guy into 300 pounds of ground mutant meat. 
And you can't hit a guy much harder than that. And that is unfortunate. Third down and long. says who's next <laughs> and it's first and ten First and ten. And he pounds the ball into the defense, picking up seven. Second and three. And they just smacked that one back in his face. Third down and three. Oh, what a great defensive play that was, Bricks. Kind of like your Aunt Bertha. This guy has some big balls. What a hit. Yeah, she does have a big pair, Grim. I thought the only tie we'd see would be a noose. Instead, they're in a dead heat. Tie game at the end of one. First down and nine. Starting to click now. A pickup of eight on the play. And that'll bring up second and one. The defense didn't give an inch. No gain on that play. And that'll bring up third and one. Just knocked the wind out of that quarterback. Jeez, I could make a kick that easy. Hell, I could make a kick that easy, and I didn't even have feet. And it's good. You know, Grim, in this league where murder and bribery are cheered, it's good to be good, huh? I mean, can we all just... Not this shit again. Bricks, I'm stopping it right there. Looks like he'll be able to run this one back if he's not terrified for his life. He is, but he's got no choice. His cleats are caked in blood and guts, and he's looking to score. Boom! And like the Titanic, his ship just went down. Huh? All I need is 77 to bite it. The burn returner was killed on that play. The coach will replace him with another player. And it's first and ten. Second down and long. If 
if there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. He's going to have the IQ of a rutabaga after that hit. And it's first and ten. I don't know whose eyes the QB is using, but can we get him some? Oh, now the offense is getting kills. Uh, this is a really violent game, guys. It's fantastic. Oh, holy Montezuma's revenge. That's a crap your pants and die tackle. Oh, that Montezuma was very vengeful, wasn't he, Bricks? Wonder what made him so mad. That was probably all the diarrhea. Yeah, you're probably right. Yeah, they probably ran out of toilet paper when he was in some all-inclusive resort, and he just got so mad and cursed everyone who came to Mexico forever to crap their pants. Uh, sounds like he didn't really think it through, because, you know, he should have made it specifically for the owners of the inclusives, but they're not the guests. What the fuck are you talking about? I don't really know right now. What day is it? And he was steering a pick six, but dropped the interception. Yeah, that's why he's on defense, schmuck. Third down and three. And the defense gets another pick. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. First and ten. <laughs> Second down and more than the QB would like. Cheap shot. <laughs> That's why I love this guy. And so do the fans. <laughs> the offense is down to their last running back. No rest for the weary. The last runner has to suck it up and hopefully not die. First down and three. Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. It's good. They need a good return here to set up the offense. They're going to be able to return this one. First and ten. The quarterback passes the ball and it rebounds back. He can't get rid of it. It's like me and these crabs, Grim. Yep, the defense calls a sticky ball dirty trick and the QB is in a heap of trouble now. Second down and a lot. 
A timeout means the QB is playing beat the clock, and he better win. And it's first and ten. And they'll keep the drive alive as he rifles it in there and picks up seven yards. And the offense quickly calls their second timeout. That's how you do it. Second and three. Oh, man, his neck vertebrae just got crunched. Sounded like a gorilla sitting on a bag of potato chips. His, oh, mama, just call him Captain Crunch. Another one bites the dust. The offense is down to their last running back. When he bites the dust, they can only pass. Yeah, well, at least they don't have to forfeit, man. That's right, but now the defense can focus on killing the receivers. And it's first and ten. And he just slipped away like a grease pig, and he finds open space. He's running toward the end zone. Turn on your jets, you son of a bitch. He's at the 30. He's at the 20. The 10. Man, oh man, he returns the interception for six points and changes the momentum of this game. The offense lost their last running back on the previous play. Next time the offense comes out on the field, they will have no running plays. And they line up for the extra point. Straight through the uprights. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. Four more downs to punish the defense. I know how to said never hit a man when he's down. It's just plain lazy. Nice extra effort there. That's it. That's their last time out. It's them against the other team and the clock. Ah, that doesn't seem fair. I'm going to throw a hammer on the field and even the odds. Montezuma's revenge. That's a crap your pants and die tackle. Oh, that Montezuma was very vengeful, wasn't he, Bricks? Wonder what made him so mad. That yeah, was probably all the diarrhea. Well, you're probably right. Yeah, they probably ran out of toilet paper when he was in some all-inclusive resort. And he just got so mad and cursed anyone who came to Mexico forever to crap their pants. Uh, sounds like he didn't really think it through because, you know, he should have made it specifically for the owners of the inclusives, but picking up the guests. What the fuck are you talking about? Uh, I don't really know. Man, are these guys greedy or desperate? Either way, they're going for two. And he breaks away. Boom, dead and down. He delivered the 
freaky fast ham sandwich with extra mustard for the death blow. Speaking of ham sandwiches, I'm gonna go grab one. You want anything? No, I'm still working on my salami here, Bricks. Thanks. That's what she said. Ah, ah, didn't work that time. It was close, though. Yep. Well, the third quarter coming up. Bricks, this game has been a hot mess so far. Yeah, kind of like the morning after eating hot chicken wings. It's a hot mess on the exit ramp, if you know what I mean. <laughs> going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty whichever if that hit didn't cripple him it certainly left skid marks and it's first and ten the sticks moving he picks up five yards on that play oh man he just went off the rails of a crazy train and murdered that guy gotta love it he should bite his head off for an encore grim second down and five first down he hit the oh and you can bury that guy because he is dead oh did you see what number he was i gotta check it off my dead mutant bingo card And it's first and ten. <laughs> Second down and ain't gonna happen, partner. And he was stuck to him like glue. Third down, and the offense needs a miracle. At this point, but oh, what a great defensive play that was, Bricks. Kind of like your Aunt Bertha. This guy has some big balls. What a hit. Yeah, she does have a big pair, Grim. You're right. And it's first and ten. Oh, and they just deflated the quarterback's balls right there. <laughs> Second down and long. And like bricks his bowels, he is loose and heading for the end zone. He could go all the way. Third down and ten. Don't do anything stupid here. Just punt the damn ball and play defense. Oh, no, no, it's a sticky ball, dirty trick. The defense pretty much turned the ball into a yo-yo of doom. Did you ever think you'd say that, Grim? And punter was killed, so now they'll need to find another player on the bench to punt from here on out. Yeah, who gives a crap about punters anyway? Punters' moms? Wives? Kids? Eh, but that's about it. And it's first and ten. And he stayed with the receiver and deflected the ball. Second down and ten. 
Crusher right there, folks. And if you don't understand why refs are hated even more than kickers, <laughs> well, there's your answer, Bricks. Oh, I hate those zebra men. <laughs> and it's first and ten. The defense had enough with this ref and jumps off sides to kill him. <laughs> First down and three. And he put on the afterburners after that catch and scored. Nicely done. Try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. It's first and ten. And the quarterback drills one in for the first down. Oh, man, he just killed that guy when the play was over. Well, if the ref didn't see it, at least the mortician did. He's coming out in the field now. another turnover for the defense. Oh, devastating hit. You ever get hit that hard, Bricks? Yep. Third grade. Sister Mary Margaret and our ladies of holy hell. I thought it was fresh. Knuckles. I thought it was just a regular Knuckles. And it's first and ten. At this point, with multiple interceptions, the cute and he's off to the races. Look at that little mutant run. Ah, I don't think Bam! Oh, man, that's the end of his day. He might want to try hurling those traps next time. First down and one. The quarterback had no time to throw, and the defense gets a big sack. Oh, that's painful. Natural Lichens lose at home by forfeit. No one's really painful. I once rubbed my eye after eating spicy chicken wings. Also chopped up a jalapeno pepper and went to take a pee. Oh, I was on fire! And let's go down to the field and hear the MVP. He's a real role model for the kids, Bricks. That is, if you want your kids to be a roid raging narcissist with uncontrollable verbal diarrhea. Well, that personality disorder has a name. It's called autotrophism. <laughs> with Brick and Mulligan and Bricks Jr. and all the folks at Evil SN want to thank you for watching this presentation of the Mutant Football League. Today's final game stats are brought to you by the Microhard Corporation. They get it right every up.